example. Everyone knows Richard's Ethel character where he is a woman, a very convincing uh, sounding woman. Anyway, uh, she calls Tradio with a ton of very valuable items. Oh. And then um, the mafia hears the call and they're trying to rip her off and it gets very, very involved on Tradio. It's a whole ah. saga that plays out. Yeah. And the Tradio host, believe it or not, gets very upset because this old woman doesn't realize the gems that she has in her house, like a painting from Picasso that she goes, I'll give for 20 bucks. She doesn't know who that is. So here it is. Ethel calls into Tradio and owns valuable items and then pretends to get robbed by the mafia. And the Tradio host gets upset. There you go. There's your setup. It's time for Tradio. If you're ready to buy, sell, or trade, you've come to the right place. Someone has taken the time to call us. I have not screened the call. Caller, you are on the phone, but you are on the radio. How are you? My name's Ethel. I got a painting from some guy named Picasso. I'll sell it for 40 bucks. Wow. Got a diamond encrusted watch from some company called Rolex. I'll take 20 bucks. And I have a old baseball card. Just hold on here. It's under a big pile of cash. Let me move that. Uh, okay. Oh, it's some rookie player named Mickey Mantle. Did you get all that? I did, but I, let me advise you. Yes, go ahead, Sonny. The things that you're talking about are worth a fortune. Don't, please do not give your location because you're on a radio station live. I just live right here in town. Yeah, I just got, come I got on that, by. I don't want you to say where you cannot say where you are. You're 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 a target. No, I don't live by Target. I live by the Walmart on 14 wow. West. Hello, caller. You're on the phone, but you're on the radio live. How are you? Hey, Sadish. This is Big Paulie Pecorino. I'm doing good since I heard Ethel calling. Can I get a phone number? No, sir. I'm not giving out her information at all. Absolutely not. I, would, I will not in any way assist with that matter because it concerns me greatly. Listen, I'm cruising past the Walmart in my Cadillac, and I'd be happy to make a quick pitch stop to, you know. I'm sorry. I praise the old boy's items. I have a bad feeling about this. I don't know where that's going, but I am I'm concerned about it and and I'm sorry. Now caller, are you still there? Yeah, this is Big Polly. I mean uh Ethel's husband. I think she's got a little confused. I mean those items are no longer available. Gavish? I'm not going to let, you've tried twice today, and I'm not going to let you talk about that on the air because I don't know what's going on with it. Well, she's got a lot of the crap around here we can get rid of. I got a sewing machine, I got a walker, I got a handicapped toilet seat. I deliberately did not give her number out because I think that she is in danger. You can imagine how a Rolex watch, diamond jewelry, Mickey Mantle baseball cards would make somebody a, a complete and total target in this community. Why your freaking bag? Oh. Oh, Ming, I thought you'd never shut the fuck I'm done with that. I was protecting her from from harm, from potentially allowing herself to open herself up to, to danger. All right. Caller, you are on the air. We have a moment. Listen, Paisan, I got to make this quick. I'm looking for a shovel, bleach, rubber gloves, Oh. And if anybody out there got a little piece of land upstate, just give me a call. Um, w? Let's get something straight. I run this radio station. We ain't putting it on the air. This damn program ain't got to be here. I'll be glad to take it off. It's a pain in the behind. Wow. So if people want to use it, they better call. <laughs> but don't call with no more mess. Because I'll be glad to take it off tomorrow. Plain and simple. Somebody write down that speech. I feel the same way about this show. <laughs> Gabi, like, oh, look, I'm ready much. to take that this show. That was a great one. Yeah, that show. This show is a pain in the ass. I, I don't need to be here. Wow, uh, that's in, uh, that's incredible. <laughs>